Hello, I'm Jonathan Esquerra and this will be my second tutorial on Blender. This one is going to be on how to create a Lomography effect on Blender. Okay, for those who doesn't know what Lomography is all about, well, in summary, uh, the, lo the Lomography comes from an old Austrian camera that took an uh, oversaturated and blurry image. Okay, now to create that effect on Blender, we're gonna be using the Compositor. Okay, once there, uh, <coughs> uh, turn on the use nodes and delete around the layer. Now add with Shift A and an image in me, and load whatever image you're going to use. Okay, this is mine. Now add with Shift A again, uh, RGB curve, and connect the image output from the original image with the actor. Now the C is going to be for the lights level so we're gonna be doing a slightly S. so as for the red color level. The green color level is gonna be just as it is and the blue color level we're gonna be doing an inverted S. Okay, now that we have that, uh, we're gonna be using a RGB to black and white node on the converter and connect, connect the image with the RGB node. Now, uh, add with Shift 8 a color mix node and connect the RGB to black and white value the second image uh, input and the RGB curves to the and change the mix type to soft light. The fact value is going to be 0.2. This this is going to be to highlight a bit more the, the shadows. Okay now gonna be Blurring a little bit the image with a blur node on the filter, mix node with the blur node, and change the blur type to fast caution. Change the x and y value to one. Okay, now we're gonna be adding a vignette effect. For this, we're gonna add under the store a lens distort knob and connect uh, the lens distort knob to the image and change the distortion distort distort the distort value to one. And let's add a math a, a math node under converter. Change the value the second value. Change it to zero and connect the image output from the lens distortion with the first value of the math node and change the math type to greater, greater than ok now add, uh, select the the blur and shift D to delete and the math value node with the image input blur the link uh, uh, turn on relief and change the value of the x and y to Point three. Now we need to mix both now effects. Now add a, a mix node on the color and connect it to the both blur effects. And change the type to multiply. So that it only takes the black part of the vignette effect and change the fact value to 1. Connect the last mix node to the composite and that should be all. Hit F12 to see how that looks and that's how you make the Lomography effect on Blender.